Hi guys, welcome to another fabulous episode of TYT University. Now, as I'm sure you know, I usually tend to talk about a little bit more serious topics, but today I thought we would spice it up a little bit, and we are going to talk about the sexiest colleges in the country. Ooh la la. Now, this is coming from the Daily Beast, who's put together a list of the 20th sexiest, 20th? of the 20 sexiest colleges in the country, uh, and they say they, quote, crunched the data for nearly 2,000 college and, colleges and universities. Now, I don't know that there's a lot of data to be crunching here, but I think we can get behind it nonetheless. So, of course, there are the more expected universities on here, like, for example, the University of Southern California is on here. Of course, that made the list because, I mean, everybody in Southern California is good looking. You've got the sun, you've got the beach, so you've got people motivated to get in good shape. And let's be real, it's LA. If you're going to pretend like LA is not incredibly superficial, you're just lying to yourself. So, of course, everybody in California is good looking. Now, a surprise, surprise uh, player on the list is the University of Iowa. Uh, now, as you know, I live in Iowa, and you might think, mm, Iowa, probably not that sexy. But let me tell you, I can actually get behind this one too, because people here are pretty good looking, I'm not going to lie. You know, there's a lot of athletes at the University of Iowa, because Iowa is such a big uh, athletic school, mostly because there's not a lot else to do here. So lots of athletes, and then lots of good looking ladies too, when you go out uh, in what is called downtown Iowa, but it's, or downtown Iowa City, but it's just like a small strip of bars, uh, the girls are getting dressed up like it's Vegas. Like these girls are going out on the town. They are very good looking. So I can get behind that. Another one that I'm sure John Idarola can get behind is the University of Texas at Austin. As I'm sure you know, he went there for a little while to get his PhD. Uh, this has the hottest guys rank uh, 8.97 out of 10, hottest girls 9.25 out of 10. So as you can tell, they're all ranking them out of 10. And then what they also have, which is cool, is the Trojan Sexual Health Ranking. And this is a list of the highest ranked health uh, sexual health schools all the way to lowest ranked. This is a really cool thing that they're including this part because there are certain universities that have like one in three people have an STD. Like I believe that um, one of the Arizona universities is still like that or at the very least was like that for a while. So that's not sexy. So I think it's cool that they're including sexual health in here as well. The Trojan sexual health rank is 15, which is pretty high. Now there are also a few other to be expected ones. A couple of universities in Miami, which Miami might as well be California. Definitely a club scene, definitely a beach scene. You have a lot of good looking people. There are also a few perhaps more surprising ones in the Midwest. And then the number one sexiest university is the University of Wisconsin-Madison, which I actually had a roommate for a little while who went there and she was definitely a sexy lady. Hot Hottest guys, uh, 9.32 out of 10. Hottest girls, 9.12 out of 10. And the Trojan Sexual Health Ranking, 5. It is the number 5 sexual healthiest school in the country. I'm not sure if that's exactly how you say that, but I think you get my point. So check out the link below for the full list. Uh, let me know if you want to go to the sexiest schools in the country or if you care more about the academic part. Maybe you'll have a win-win and find both. Uh, check out my new website, lisaferguson.tv. Follow me on Facebook, Lisa Ferguson TV. Like and subscribe to CYTU, and we'll see you next time.